Another one. Another one. Another one. And another one. So crazy, man. It's like, it breaks my heart. Nah, it really fucking breaks my heart. That there's people out there that don't believe in us. You ever felt like no matter how hard you work, how hard you hustle, you just can't catch that break. You can't get over that hump. You ain't got no support. Nobody backing you. It's like, they ain't believe in me. God, God did. did. Welcome to the Sneaker Cave. This your boy, Brandon. Yeah, that's right. The coolest YouTuber ever. And I'm back with another, another crazy video. And as you see that thumbnail, as you read that title, as you see this box, yes, I have probably the best quality Jordan of 2022. We the best Jordan 5s. DJ Khaled really did his thing with these. So if you ready, I'm ready. Let's get right to it. Burn, burn, burn. Like I always say, if you can give me a big thumbs up, slap that subscribe button, tap the bell, tap on so you know that every time your boy drop a banging video like this one. So without further ado, I got the grade school pair and I got the men's pair to see if the quality different. Cause lately the, the grade school has been kind of killing the men pairs, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna we're gonna put these men pairs over here for a minute. And we're gonna get to these grade schools. Uh, like the little we the best plastic stuff. This is how you know when you got a uh, a dope shoe is the presentation, you know what I'm saying? Like you got this little stuff on there, say keep going, we the best, little Jordan pink and stuff. To be honest, I'm gonna give y'all my honest opinion on the colorway, on what I think about the shoe, uh, why I think people don't like it, why I think people, some people do like it, why I kind of got, had a lot of hype and a dab by the time it came out. We're gonna talk about all that in this video, so. Let's get uh, straight to it. I like the little peach slash pink by Miami vibe, I guess, cause he's from Miami, I guess. You know, a little paper. And you know, the boy looking hard already. Okay, 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 okay. Callie D doing his thing, and then that's in the box. Nope. Got the little, let's see. Oh, okay, it is something in the box, little. All grade school pair come with this little sticker. I don't know why men's don't, but grade school come with that sticker. So you in the stickers for your kids or something, y'all can give it to them. We're gonna just do this real quick, okay. So it come with three laces, well four. Got the peach, the black, the blue, and the sal, I guess. That's that's cool, that's cool. So we're gonna put this here for a minute, and then we're gonna do this real quick. Already know. These, <laughs> these boys is hard. You know, I say the, the real bang for when I do the men pair, but these boys is hard though. I just want to check these out real quick. You know what I'm saying? I see a little default, I mean a little defection, a little QC problems a little bit. I don't know if you can see this. Look, can you see that right there or right above the blue part? It's a little, I don't know if you can see that, but a little paint, nothing, nothing major, but the quality already, even on the gray schools, it's dope with this quilt. Man, these, these is, yeah. Well, let's get the grades. Let's get the, uh, the men pair out real quick. We'll get the men pair going. Come on, the same thing. Same box, same thing. Put that over there. And I like the jump man though. You know what I'm saying, let's read the box. It says Air Jordan 5 Retro SP Crimson Bliss Blue Sal 
This is actually a 10 and a half, which is still my size. You know I wear 11, but 10 and a half is cool in these two. Same presentation with that. I'm, I'm pretty sure the men don't get a star. I mean, the little Jordan thing, you know what I'm saying? Let me see. I know they don't. No sir. So we're going to keep out. Uh... Oh, I didn't notice that too. Okay. We're going to keep out. I don't need both of them because I got one of them. I'm going to keep the same one all the we gonna keep it right here. Matter of fact, we're gonna keep it on too. That oh, way I can just check it out. I'll move it over here. I can check the grade school quality and the man quality. But um This one you gotta be special, you know? You gotta Woo! <laughs> Wait, hold on. Man, they need to bottle that and sell it as cologne. I'll be having on right now. Woo, shining something up, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Strings y'all putting in it? Y'all putting in the white? Y'all putting in the black? I don't know about the black. I mean, the black I guess may actually be dope, but I just like that blue. I think that blue is hard too. The peach is cool, you know what I'm saying? But they don't really do no justice to break and the shoes stand out. But you see what I'm saying? What Khaled did to the shoes, he put the best quality. He put the fancy designs. He gave you four laces for the price of 225. Four laces. Look at this. We the best in there. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't beat that. All, all Jordan shoes, if you're going to charge 200 and up, make it special, man. Make the box special. Come with something, you know what I'm saying? Just a little bit. Just to make a sneaker head feel like we're getting a bang for our buck. But I like how I say, this one say, hold on. You can see that. I say, keep. This one say, going. Keep going. We the best all in the inside. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see it. You probably can't see it. But okay, so we the best is on this one. And the Jordan symbol is on this one. To show y'all the collaboration. I kind of alright, let me show you, let me tell you what I wish was different. For one, this color really is different. That's why I wanted them. It's really not my color that I wear anything, but this was so unique and so different. I I felt like I had to get it. But I wish this was blue. I wish these little neck guard things was blue. You know what I'm saying? That'd be hard. Um, I like the 3M tongue, the black Jordan jump man. That's dope. I wish he put his logo on the top. We the best right there. That'd have been cold. On the opposite pair that don't have we the best that just got the Nike sign. I think he should put his logo right there. Keep, you know what I'm saying? Jordan logo on here, his logo right there. That'd have been dope too. Um, I wish this white part was blue. This should have been baby blue, just or black, you know what I'm saying? Brought out the shoe more. Uh, it ain't much I would have did differently because the quality on here is amazing. I'm telling you right now, man, people is going to be mad. I like how this switch from that peach is blend up to that cell. That's dope. But people going to be regretting this in a couple of years that you didn't pick these up. And I just got a feeling you could say I'm completely wrong, I'm dead wrong. That's fine. I think it's going to be a 400 plus shoe in a couple of years. I just think it will be a $400 plus shoe. You know what I'm saying? When it's the smoke all clear and... 
whatever. And the only reason why, this, this is how the sneaker game works. So when something is dope to the resellers are talking about it and they know I can make a lot of money, like I don't know if you can see them, but the, um, the lost and founds, if that shoe tanked as much as this shoe to $200 right now, that would not be the shoe of the year. Nobody would be talking about it. It'd just be another Jordan 1. But because the resale is through the roof on there, people love that shoe, right? When this first came, was coming out and announced, everybody, all the sneakerheads, the whole sneaker community was talking about this, how they wanted these, the dope. You know what I'm saying? Even whether they like the color or not, they're like, they got to have them because the retail, the resale value was like 600 or seven at the time. I can't remember what it was, but as soon as they came out and that price tanked to $250 or something like that, they trashed. Come on, man. Anyway, back to these shoes. I think this is the best quality Jordan of 2022. Now, that's a couple other ones. Um, I think the orange starfishes, I don't know if you can see them right here. That quality is amazing on the Jordan 1. A lot of Jordan 1s is dope, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's, it's a lot of Jordan 1s. It's a lot of dope shoes that got great quality, but I think this is the best one to me. Me personally, I think this is the best one. Best one made. It's, this leather is buttery. You have to have these in hand to understand. Like, like look at the leather. Like, you think because it's like cracking like that, that it's made horribly? No, it's because it's so soft. This is a buttery leather. Some people are like, my quality is trash. Man, when you get leather, it's going to wrinkle. It's going to crease. There's nothing you can do about it. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving these a sneaker cave 10 out of a 10. DJ Khaled, man, you got another one with this. I don't mean another shoe. You got another classic thing that you did with these joints, man. These is fire. One of my favorite shoes of the year. And I didn't, this was not on my radar because I don't like Pascal or whatever they call them colors. I don't like that purple. They had the pink. The blue looks sweet. And the, actually, the actual purple and the blue on it that he saved for friends and family, I think um, is dope. Those colors are dope. I don't really care for this color too much or the other ones, those sal and purple looking ones. I would never have them. Them is too girly for me. These is to me girly too, but I still think a man or a woman could, I mean, it's shoes, you can wear what you wanna wear. I ain't knocking nobody for wearing purple, pink, green, whatever. I'm just saying me personally, my personal opinion for me, what I wear is I wanted these cause I have nothing, nothing in my sneaker collection like these, even remotely close to this. It was a must cop for me. For one, it was DJ Khaled. For two, I'm like the details, the quality, the color. When I wanna rock something that just completely off the wall different, throwing on we the best people buy things based off other people opinions you know what i'm saying how weird that sound but a lot of people if if all the bigger youtubers or bigger sneaker people was going for one shoe is why everybody wants it like the lost and found people it's not that that shoe is the best quality shoe in the world most people don't even want no shoe that's look old school you know what i'm saying with the old school little feel to it it ain't even that it's that the fact that everybody wants to shoot and how hard it is to get is the only reason why everybody like, I have, you got people wanting this shoe don't even like red. Who don't even like Jordans? Who don't even like the Bulls? But they want this shoe because based off hype. It is what it is. I ain't ranting, I'm just stating facts. And you know, people only like what other people like. Even this is like a, a off, off cover. That's dope, man. This is a 10 out of a 10, man. One of the best Jordans of 2022. You could say I'm lying. I see some more plastic on here. I can get that off. Every shoe got quality issues, but I mean, let me show you so you can see that what I'm talking about. See that little thing right there? But I can get that off. They're coming off now. But one of the best shoes. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Do you think they're completely trash because you just don't like the colorway? You don't rock with DJ Khaled or you don't rock with Fives? If your answer is based off that, you know, I feel you. You don't like the color, you don't like DJ Khaled, and you don't like Jordan Fives. Cool. Gucci. I get it. But the only reason why you don't like them is because they bricks. Your, your opinion is not, is not valid. Your opinion is not respected. This is not. So anyway, with that being said, this your boy Brandon. Yeah, that's right. The realest, the coolest, the dopest, the handsomest YouTuber ever. And I'm signing out with another banging video, man. Thank you guys for watching, man. Thank you guys for getting me to 1,000 subscribers. You made this part of the video. Yeah, because you're real support. This video is a little easier than normal. Because I just wanted to really talk about a little stuff. And uh, uh, we made it, man. A thousand subscribers. I do got a separate video. You know, thank you guys. That I'm coming out with this week. A um, thousand subscriber um, video. And uh, the giveaway announcement. When I'm going to give away. And when I'm going to give it away. You know, stuff like that. 
that's coming up. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Stop what you're doing right now. Hit that subscribe button. Give your boy a thumbs up. You know what I'm saying? Hit the bell so you you know when I'm doing that giveaway so you can be a part of it if you want to be a part of it. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, man. I'm out of here, man. I'm tired. It's early in the morning. I'm out. Peace!